If you do a search for the term Renaissance man, you might find a picture of Bobby Satcher. A NASA astronaut recently returned from a 4.5 million mile trip to the International Space Station on STS-129, Satcher is also a surgeon with specialties in orthopedics and musculoskeletal oncology. He has a Ph.D. in chemical engineering from MIT and a doctorate of medicine from Harvard Medical School. I think my grandmother made it to seventh grade and my grandfather made it to fifth grade or something like that. Um, and so despite that, they, they understood how important education was and they, all of their kids, and they had a large family, you know, of, of nine children and they all finished college and got college degrees. And several of them, of course, went on and got advanced degrees, MDs, PhDs. And so they always stress that to us. Satcher was bit by the exploration bug early in life. He practically grew up on the campus of the historically black Hampton University in Hampton, Virginia, where his father was a professor. An avid encyclopedia reader, he would stroll the idyllic Tidewater Peninsula and imagine the possibilities. And I read all about history of exploration, um, you know, the Europeans traveling the oceans and, and coming to what we now know as the Americas. And, and so when I'd be out strolling along the, the seashore, I'd be thinking about that, looking out, thinking about, you know, what it must have been like hundreds of years before to, to, to put it all on the line and, and to go out and not knowing if you would make it back, um, not knowing what you were going to find and just how exciting that was. Satcher's dreams of exploring space came true in November 2009 as a mission specialist on the 31st shuttle flight to the International Space Station. He performed two spacewalks for a total of 12 hours and 19 minutes outside the station. Well. Now we got back to Bobby Satcher on the arm, heading out to do some uh, looting on the TSA. Dr. Satcher's other passion is yeah, medicine, and he's used okay. his considerable medical expertise to help people from Chicago to the African continent. I went to uh, West Africa and spent four months working in a clinic in, uh, in Gabon, which is a kind of a small country in West Africa, and uh, had the opportunity to you know, deliver health care to, to groups of people who really had not had the privilege of a, uh, a reasonable, what I would say is just a reasonable health care infrastructure. Um, most people in that country, and unfortunately in a lot of uh, countries that are, that are the poorer countries in the world, they don't have access to regular health care. So, um, you know, people can go their entire lives and never come in contact with, uh, with a doctor. Satcher has found inspiration in other astronauts, like the late Dr. Ronald McNair, a fellow MIT alum and South Carolina native, and other doctor astronauts like Scott Parazinski. He is the recipient of numerous fellowships and awards, including the Leadership Fellow of American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons, a Robert Wood Johnson Foundation Fellowship, and membership in the Tau Beta Pi Engineering Honor Society. Looking good. Good to go.